Uh, Rupert Henry, uh, an interesting race, maybe not quite come out the way you'd hope, but there must have been some, uh, there must have been some good times there. Uh, some good rides, definitely. Um, yeah, but I think the the forecast sort of spelled it for us early on. We knew we wouldn't be able to get a break on the um, the TPs, so um, we tried a thing or two through the trough, to, which seemed like it was working for a while, and then it didn't work, but um, the Derwent was the... Uh, Final decider, really. And Stu was saying, though, you caught a bit back up further down into Storm Bay and things. Yeah, well, we came around the corner and there were six boats in front of us just going nowhere. So um, that happens. <laughs> and generally the boat's gone well, no breakages, all good? No breakages, the boat was fabulous. Yeah, it was just um, the forecast was suited some and not us, but anyway. And comfortable to steer in that first night? I mean, in so far as it is in that downwind stuff? Uh, first night was fantastic, yeah. Yeah, it was um, some great rides, almost 30 knots quite a few times, so um, yeah, blew out one spinnaker, <laughs> yeah, only one, which is good. Yeah. So you're coming back again next year? Uh, ask me tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was obviously a uh, fast race as forecast and you know, we've got to congratulate the, the Loyal and Jack Giacomo particularly for having a fantastic race and smashing the record. Um, for us things didn't quite turn out as we might have hoped for a few different reasons, but uh, we're all very happy to be here. The boat went well, no damage? Uh, no damage at all, no. The guys did an excellent job in preparing the boat and no complaints there. And how was that first afternoon? You must have been sending it, weren't you? Yeah, it was good fun. It's always nice sailing downwind when you don't have a bottom mark to go to. <laughs> and uh, where did it really sort of come unstuck for you guys particularly? Um, in the first night, the transition zone, we got ourselves in slightly the wrong spot and then really tough to recover after that. Um, and they, yeah, never quite had the same breeze that some of the other boats had, so kicking ourselves for that. Um, but, you know, as with all these races, never over till it's over and we made some really nice gains up Storm Bay and then, a, you know, lost out a little bit again at the end in, in the Derwent's. It's the way the race goes. And did you, did you just go a bit wide in the, in, in the first evening? Uh, quite the opposite. We were, we were one of the more western boats, which didn't uh, initially it was okay, and then it didn't pan out. So it just didn't set you up for the next phase. That's ex exactly right. Yeah.